What's up everybody? Well, I got another gameplay video for you guys today on the secondary computer here. And today we're gonna have a look at Warhammer Vermintide 2. And it ran pretty decently on everything. It got a little stuttery at, at 1080p on the Asus G15 Advantage, but other than that, it was fine at 1440p and it was fine on everything else. Couldn't stay at 60 on everything, but it did once we got up to the Alienware, so that's good enough for me. So this one hopefully will make me be stutter free. That'd be cool. Maybe the VCash will play hand in hand at being making this a perfectly butter smooth experience. But I have a feeling this kind of game just has some random stutters every now and again. Just do that DirectX 12 nonsense. But anyway, let's stop blabbing and let's go hop ourselves into the game. All right, here's the settings we're gonna go with on this PC here. Ready, full screen, 1440. No V-Sync or anything like that and pretty much just maxed out settings. Just turned a couple of visual things I don't particularly like, like motion blur, depth of field, that kind of thing off. And there we go, that's the bottom. Let's go see how it does. All right, here we go. Let's see what kind of performance we get with this. If I remember correctly, this one actually stuttered quite a bit. I understand we're approaching the city wall. What can go wrong with that? But then I noticed that the stuttering happens a lot on whatever you play on, so. Surprisingly, besides the laptops, the laptops probably did the best job, actually. Although once I stopped recording, both of the desk all the desktops seem to do a lot better. Although I'd still say this one still did the worst out of all of them. I don't know why. Maybe it just hates the AMD GPU. But that doesn't make sense because the hey, laptops are both all AMD. I don't know. Maybe I got some settings messed up somewhere. Cause it's, but it's completely smooth in other games, so I doubt it. Let's just hate this game. There it is set up for some reason. Ooh, a bomb. I wish I knew how to do it. And that's interesting, because it was pretty dang smooth at some points here, but then other points it just kind of falls flat on its face and stutters. Fear not, Mayflies. There's nothing worse than us loose in this night. That thunderstorm's rolling in. But it's whatever. Even if we lose power for a second, I got... Uh, what do you call them? Those uninterruptible power supplies. On all except for my TV PC. I should probably get one of those. Protect all my expensive components and my TV. And sound system, for that matter. I think I'll have to get a pretty beefy one to do all that, though. Someone should do something about the bodies. Busy fighting rats, just like us, I suppose. Right, let's go down over here. Oh no, I've been captured.
All right, I guess we should turn this thing now. Oh, I guess I don't have to climb to turn it. Thought I had to do all up the stairs there, but nope. Potion of Concentration. I feel like that's probably more for a mage, but I could be wrong. smoother in the arena. Still has a random stutter as you can see every now and again, but... Got him in the face pretty effortlessly. I mean, I've been good with guns and controllers, but it's not like this is a Twitch first person shooter, so. Alright, let's get some camera recording gameplay here. Smell charred. I have scores 
to set off. Stairs. File chase. Needs hops. You ever wonder what's going on back home, would tell me? Why think on matters you'll never witness? Why invite that sort of typical elf? Three things in absolute. This from a dwarf. Do you think on your own? Alright guys, that's a wrap for Warhammer Vermintide 2 on the secondary computer here and it handled it pretty much no problem FPS wise but it had some stutters too. Very similar to the kind of that Asus was getting at 1080p but this was at you know 3440, 1440 ultra wide but it is what it is. It still is playable. I wished it was smoother but I'm kind of curious to see how it runs on the main computer. Let's see if Intel could give us the smoothness I want. Sometimes this computer does better, sometimes the Intel does better. That's why I'm glad I've got both. But anyway, that's all I got for you guys for this particular video. I hope you guys enjoyed the video, because I sure as hell enjoyed making it for you guys. And until the next video, peace out, guys.